Hello everyone, my name is Isaac Meisner and today I want to invite you to join me in learning more about the history and the achievements of the biggest baking company in the world, Grupo Bimbo. The idea of establishing a baking company named Bimbo was born December 2nd, 1945 in the capital city of Mexico or CDMX. Nevertheless, it was until two years later that Panificación Bimbo Sociedad Anónima was created as a brand alongside its famous logo, Osito Bimbo. Trademark. It is said that the logo was inspired by a Christmas card one of the original founders received. At the same time, it is believed that the name Bimbo was chosen for its similarity to the word bingo, usually used to express success. The first products to be sold were white bread, dog bread, and toast. During the 50s, the company distributed its products in many creative ways. One great example was a vehicle named the 38 that had a built-in megaphone that announced its arrival in more secluded parts of the city. Similarly, some iconic pastries of the brand were born, including mini donuts and chocolate and jam filled treats, as well as its first sub brand cake, currently Marinella, that has a bigger focus on recreating Americanized snacks. This would offer a wider variety of products like popcorn, candy, and tortillas. Its notable presence in five out of six continents includes Asia and Europe. This since Bimbo is a worldwide brand, which means that its reach has overcome Mexico and Latin America. In the next few decades, the strategy was clear. Build a dozen factories throughout Mexico and acquire all re-established brands in the US and abroad. You might not be aware of this, but Grupo Bimbo might be available in your country very, very easily. One of the many acquisitions in the US market have been Sara Lee and Oro Wheat, while in China this giant of the food industry purchased Van Rico, one of the largest bakery groups in Asia. Since 2011, Grupo Bimbo became the largest baking company not only in the United States, but in the world. Besides its variety of products, what has brought success to the company has been adapting to foreign markets while being sustainable and innovative. Today, the company runs under Daniel Servirje, son of Lorenzo Servirje, the main founder of the company. 32 countries, 13,000 products, 100 brands, 199 factories. Disculpa, me das un autógrafo? According to Forbes, Grupo Bimbo is one of the enterprises that report some of the biggest sales, highest value in the market worldwide. As a proud Mexican, it is an honor to be able to say that a Mexican company is the number one in the whole world. Remember that in order to succeed, you must work hard every day. But to stand out, you have to think outside the box.